Okay, the next uh, the next log function that we look at is uh, when something is logged to the the base e. Now, what's e? Now, e you might have a or you should already know is a uh, is the is called the natural exponential. Okay, so e oops e is uh, natural exponential okay which is approximately equal to so it's not exactly equal to um, it is approximately equal to 2.7182 okay so that uh, that is what, what uh, e is approximately equal to whereas uh, in the previous uh, session you saw that uh, the logs were raised to the uh, it was to the base 10 now we have e as a base okay so we've written e over there you could have just as well written this value of 2.7197828 uh, in the, in that um, um, in that spot there okay so what does this mean the same as we had written before for when it was to the base of 10 now the base is e so you'd say e to the power of x is equal to a okay that's effectively saying that 2.7188 to the power of x is equal to a all right that's the starting point that's uh, uh that that's what this expression means all right so now what would happen is if you had a problem with uh, where, where you had a, an exponential function with a um, uh, with a value of, of e given um as that um so it would be e to the power of x equals a um and you needed to find what x was okay so let's uh, again look at uh, just look at a quick example let's say you had let's say you had um, something which said e to the power of x is equal to 50 okay you know what e is I mean e is just that value there what, what you'd need is what's x okay it's the value of x that you're not sure about okay so what you'd say in that case is log to the base e of 50 will give you the value of x okay so how do you find this now uh, in the last example we looked at, at using the calculator to find something at log to the base uh, of 10 okay now we do the same thing uh, with this again we bring out a calculator um, now just a word of note that the log to the base e or the natural logarithm is usually represented as l n okay so on the calculator you will see it as the button l n and also in 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 books and 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 textbooks what uh, we tend to write to differentiate between log to the base e and log to the base n um, usually the way to write this would be l n 50 okay this is exactly the same as writing log to the base e of 50 okay um, just while we're there in in most cases if something is to the base 10 people don't write 10 they just write log okay if something is just written as log of a that will usually mean log base 10 of a okay so when it's to the base e it's ln or pronounced or I guess uh, pronounced ln in many cases so ln 50 is equal to log uh, exactly equal to log to the base e of 50 okay so back to our problem here up here which is um what we needed what do we need uh, what would the val what value of x would give us 50 okay so moving back up here I'll just rewrite that okay e to the x is equal to 50 okay hopefully one day I'll get used to writing with this pen all right so there we go um, I need to write this out in that form there okay so on the calculator there's that button so oops, it's off let's clear that 
okay 50 50 okay so I've got there lon or log to the base e of 50 enter and we get a value of x as 3.912 so in this case now after we do lon 50 equals x which is equal to 3.912 2 approximately it's not exactly equal to that there are a few more values that follow okay so now if we were to go back and do the same substitution as we had done before when we looked for something to the power of uh, to, uh, to, uh, when we used base 10 so if we said now e to 3 oops, don't like that 3.912 nine one two this is equal to that is messy I don't like that equal sign get rid of that okay is equal to so we'll bring the calculator back how do we do this okay again over here you'll see and it's pretty tiny there but um, there's e to the power of x um, you'll see if I press the second function okay it's given me e to the power of okay and the value is approximately 3.912 close those brackets bring it back down here so I've put that in okay that's uh, same as that there okay enter and I end up with 49.9988 Okay, this was an approximation up here. Okay, had I put in the full value, I would have been closer to 50. Okay, so that uh, is very close to 50. Okay, so we've found for the natural exponential, we've got a natural um, logarithm. This the relationship between the two. Okay, um, just uh, going back up to the top. Okay, so the the, the relationship that we look at is really between uh, that there and that over there okay so if you had a value uh, or uh, x raised to uh, e raised to the power of x you would use the natural uh, logarithm to uh, val uh, function to find it, uh, find the value of x okay so that's uh, that's the natural logarithm